In 1864, an entire New Mexico settlement was massacred by a band of renegade Apaches. I hope he was dead when they did that to him. If he was dead, they wouldn't have bothered. Major Amos Dundee was assigned to assemble a hunting party. I want some volunteers, men who can ride, men who can shoot. Return, I promise you nothing. But with the Civil War still raging, he was forced to fill out his ranks with Confederate prisoners, freed slaves, deserters, and outright criminals. I didn't sign on to go chasing after no homesick soldier boys. Which raises the question, who poses the greater threat? Jailer. <laughs> Major Dundee was Sam Peckinpah's first large-scale film, and also the first to be taken away from him and recut. My executioners will have to stand in line. But now, on its 40th anniversary, most of the missing footage has been located and restored. A brand new score composed, and the entire soundtrack remixed in 5.1 Dolby Digital. The result is a new masterpiece, as close to Sam's original vision as possible. I'm fighting for the only country I have left, and I kill men in a hopeless war for it. Major Dundee explodes with all the excitement, intensity, and passion that made Peck and Paul one of America's most original and dynamic filmmakers. He just plain clean shot a hole in me. Now you know I ain't no deserter. I was fixed to come back, I was. And it features one of the finest casts ever assembled for a Western. Charlton Heston, Richard Harris, James Coburn, Jim Hutton, Michael Anderson Jr., Santa Berger, Ben Johnson, Warren Oates, Brock Peters, Slim Pickens, Duff Taylor, R.G. Armstrong, and me, L.Q. Jones. I intend to smite the wicked, not save the heathen. Don't miss Sam Peckinpah's first great epic, as it was always meant to be seen, but never has until now. Until the Apache is taken or destroyed. Major Dundee, the extended version. Now, Major, are across the river in Texas. Right now is just fine, Ben.